Hello, welcome to this mathematics session. Today we are going to look at uh, variations. We have uh, four types of variations. We have uh, number one, direct variation, joint variation, inverse variation, combined variation. So for the purpose of this video, we are going to look at uh, direct variation today. So variation, the most important uh, points that you need to know is that if you have an increase in Y, it will cause an increase in X. If you have a decrease in Y, it will cause a decrease in X. So let us look at uh, the examples. So if I've got Y equals 4 and X is equal to 2. So if I decide to increase uh, this Y by 2, it will be uh, 4 times 2, it will be 8. Y will become uh, y will become 8. I will also increase x by the same uh, value times 2. It will be x will become 4. Similarly, if I decide to reduce y and x by the same value, for example, divide by 2, also I divide by 2. So my x will become 1 then my y will become uh, 2 into 4 is 2. So that's what it means. So the number that I've, I've, I've used 2 is what we call the constant, which is k. It doesn't change. So for us to, to find the answers uh, to variation questions, we need to know uh, the value of k. So let us first look at how we can write the relationships involving the k, the constant. So example one, uh, y varies direct as x. So you underline varies directly as. So this will be replaced by the symbol for variation. So y varies directly as x. So immediately after the variation symbol, you put your constant value by which y is increasing or decreasing. So, replacing the variation symbol by the equal sign, your equation will look like this. This is the relationship that you use to find answers to the values of y or values of k and values of x variables. Number two, y varies directly as a square of x. So here, two important key terms, varies direct as and square or square of square of x you should know that you are multiplying x twice which will be x to the power 2 so y varies directly as the square of x then you fix your constant there so y is equal to k x squared this is your, your relationship number three y varies directly as the cube of x so also here you underline varies directly as then cube of x you should know that x to the power 3 so y varies directly as the cube of x you put your case so your relationship will be y is equal to kx to the power 3 this is your relationship so let us see how we can solve uh, direct variations here is an example Given that y varies direct as z and that y is equal to 10 when x is equal to 5. So first of all, we have to write the, the relationship. y varies directly as z. So I'll use this part. So y varies directly as z. I'll put my constant here. So y is equal to kz. So you need to find the value of constant. So the first uh, set of numbers, they will help you find the constant. So we substitute where there is a y, we put 10. So 10 is equal to k times x is what? 5. So this one will be 10 is equal to 5k. There, 5. There, 5. You divide 5 there, 1. 5 there 1, 5 there 2. So 2 is equal to k. So therefore, your constant is equal to 2. So now, we have found 
this uh, the value of find the value of k the constant of variation which is uh, number one then uh, number two y when x is equal to 20 so y when uh, x is equal to 20 so we get our equation there we say y is equal to kx so y is equal to already we have found the constant which is two so where there is k we put two times z the x uh, here sorry this is uh, this is a uh, z so here our value for for z sorry for that mistake is uh, 20 so 20 there so y is equal to uh, 20 times 2 is 40 so this is number number two number three we find z when y is equal to 22 so number three y is equal to k z so we have to make this z the subject so we can say over k over k there you cancel so z is equal to y over k so z is equal to y is equal to 22 and our constant is 2 so z is equal to 11 so this is how direct variation operates so uh, you have to watch the video several times so that you understand what is happening and then the the quiz will follow after i'll be able to post in the group thank you for your attention and i hope that uh, those who are watching this video will be able to join our group thank you